Cats are definitely a true emotional mystery. Although they may seem independent, these adorable felines have more feelings than you might imagine. Have you ever wondered if your cat feels remorse after mischief or how they apologize? In this video, I'll explain the mystery surrounding feline apologies. Without further ado, let's get started. Understanding Cat Emotions How do cat emotions work? Cats are complex beings endowed with a rich emotional life that often surprises us with its depth and diversity. Like us humans, they experience a wide range of emotions from love and happiness to sadness and anger. Feline love is a beautiful and powerful thing. Cats are capable of forming deep and lasting bonds with their caregivers and feline companions. They express their love in subtle ways such as praying while being petted, rubbing against their caretaker's legs, or simply sharing the same space. These gestures of affection are an expression of the deep emotional bond that cats develop with those who care for them. A cat's happiness can be seen in their carefree and relaxed behavior when they feel safe and comfortable in their environment. Cats can be seen playfully frolicking, rolling over belly up, and even purring contentedly. These moments of happiness are precious to cat lovers as they reveal the joyful and laid-back side of the feline personality. If your cat is calm, they are happy. However, cats can also experience darker emotions such as sadness and depression. Changes in their environment, such as the loss of a feline or human companion, a change of residence, or prolonged absence from their caregivers, can trigger feelings of sadness and melancholy in cats. They may become withdrawn, lose interest in play, and become less affectionate. It is important to be attentive to these signs and offer emotional support to your cat during these difficult times. Like humans, cats can also feel anger and frustration in certain situations. This can be triggered by changes in their routine, negative interactions with other animals or humans, or even simply not getting what they want. Cats can express their anger through aggressive vocalizations such as growls and hisses, or even through aggressive behaviors such as scratching or biting. It is important to handle these emotions calmly and compassionately, providing your cat with a safe and predictable environment to calm down. Do cats know when they misbehave? Do cats know when they misbehave? The first point to consider is whether cats distinguish between good and bad behavior. The answer to that question is simple. No, they do not have that innate sense of right and wrong. For example, your cat does not understand why they shouldn't knock over that vase on the table or why scratching the sofa is wrong. However, this does not mean that your feline friend is oblivious to your reactions. While they may not understand the morality of their actions, they definitely perceive when they have done something that displeases you. And how do they know? Because you are like an open book to them. Your expressions, your tone of voice, and even your posture give them very clear clues. An animal cognition study has shown that cats are actually sensitive to the sound of our voices. When you are happy, your tone is friendly, something your cat associates with happy moments like when you pet or feed them. But if you are upset, your voice sounds very different, and your cat can easily pick up on that. Understanding cat communication, cats realize when something is wrong. In addition to listening, they also observe. A study conducted by the University of Bari in Italy found that cats can read our emotions through facial gestures. A smile or a furrowed brow tells them a story. So, more than understanding what is good or bad, cats learn from our responses. If we react in a certain way to a behavior, they will associate that behavior with that response. So much of what they learn about what is right or wrong will depend on us.
We are their guides. Can cats actually apologize? After understanding how they perceive our emotional responses, an inevitable question arises. Can cats really apologize? Here's the news. Cats do not feel that emotional complexity we know as guilt. That is, if you expect your cat to come with a repentant look saying sorry in their feline way, you can keep waiting because that's not going to happen. However, while cats do not understand the concept of remorse, they do understand when you are upset or angry with them, and that's when they will try to reconnect with you. If your cat approaches you with affection after naughty behavior, it's not exactly an apology but rather a way of saying, I don't like it when you're upset, let's be okay. Despite their independence and self-sufficiency, cats value the connection with their humans very much. They can be territorial and could live without us, but that doesn't mean they don't form very deep emotional bonds. Although they don't feel guilty, they will seek ways to reconnect with you and ensure that everything is okay between the two of you. 9 Ways Cats Apologize Pring If humans had a universal sound to express peace, it would be pring. Cats make this sound. They can't say sorry, but if you hear prolonged purring after mischief, they are very likely trying to communicate with you. Purring is often associated with comfort and tranquility, and its intensity can be a way of apologizing. Slow blinking. In the language of cats, slow blinking can be a deep expression of trust and relaxation. When they do this while looking into your eyes after mischief, it's like they're sending little visual kisses, hoping that your sweet gaze will make you forget about that broken vase in your living room. Licking or nuzzling. Mutual grooming between cats strengthens bonds. If your cat decides to, more ways cats apologize, licking your hand or face. If your cat licks your hand or face, it's a way of taking care of you, especially after misbehaving. It's a kind of apology saying, despite what I did, we're still family. Head bumping. Every time your cat rubs against you or gives you a little headbutt, they are depositing pheromones. It's their way of saying, you're mine, and reaffirming the bond with you. It's a sign of affection and trust, so when your feline does this after mischief, it's like they're saying, we're still friends, right? Kneading with paws. The famous Making Biscuits Act reminds the cat of their infancy when they needed their mother's belly before feeding. If after an unlovely act your cat starts kneading, they may be seeking both your comfort and offering a silent apology. Showing the belly. The belly is the most vulnerable part of a cat. When they show it, they are making a big act of trust. Showing the belly can be a way of admitting a mistake and showing vulnerability. Giving gifts. There's nothing like a gift from your cat to get your attention. Although it can be quite unsettling to find a mouse in your room, it's their way of sharing their hunt with you. It may be an attempt to make up for those sharp claws on your sofa a quirky apology that says, brought this for you, we're okay. Approaching you with tail up. Has your cat, after mischief, come to you with their tail up? This act is an invitation to interaction and may be their way of saying, Don't ignore me, I still want to be close to you. It's a very subtle but powerful gesture of reconciliation. Initiating play. Play is vital for cats after undesirable behavior. If your cat brings their favorite toy or starts playing around you, they are likely trying to rebuild the relationship between you. It's a very playful way of saying, come on, you can't stay mad for long. These are just some of the unique and charming ways our cats may try to apologize. Although they don't understand the human concept of apology, they definitely have ways to show they care about us. If you've made it this far into the video, it's because you love our free friends. 
So, I ask you, do you know how to show love to your cat in a way they understand?